Hello. Thanks for joining us today. We're here today to talk about legislation to remove the antitrust exemption that's long been enjoyed by Major League Baseball. It's important to remember that this exemption was created from whole cloth by the Supreme Court 99 years ago. In an opinion authored by Justice Oliver Wendell Holmes, Jr., the Supreme Court said that Major League Baseball simply would not be covered by our antitrust laws. That means that this exemption never saw the light of day in Congress. It was not put in place legislatively, and it is a distinctively legislative decision. It's not a ruling that it enjoys any support, either from the statutory text or anything in the Constitution. We have to remember the reason we have antitrust laws to begin with. We have them because we want to protect competition. Competition is good because we found over time that competition tends to bring down prices and it tends to increase quality. When we allow people to collude, to engage in activity to enhance and perpetuate their own market dominance and defend their own monopolistic position, competition itself suffers and especially consumers suffer. So if we are going to deviate from the norm established by our antitrust laws, those deviations need to be considered and carefully weighed and balanced, and, and they need to be ultimately enacted by Congress, not simply put in place by the Supreme Court. Now, yes, this is precedent. It's precedent that has been in place since 1922. But it's not precedent that we're powerless to address. In fact, we have the ability, uh, uh, through legislation, to undo it, and that's precisely what we're doing. There's no reason that Major League Baseball should be treated any differently than any other professional sports leagues in America. Uh, no reason why they ought to have preferential treatment relative to uh, the NFL or the NBA or any other professional athletic organization. Nor is there, to my knowledge, any decent argument why baseball is itself different from any of those other sports or why uh, Major League Baseball should enjoy exemptions not held by other corporations generally, regardless of whether they have anything to do with professional sports. This is good legislation. This is the type of legislative housekeeping that we need to undertake from time to time, especially when we discover that the Supreme Court of the United States has impermissibly stepped into the legislative thicket. That's our job, and our job is ultimately about protecting competition. I'm grateful to be joined uh, uh, by my two friends and colleagues, Senator Cruz from Texas and Senator Hawley from Missouri. We will now hear from them in that order.